Cooking with Kids today. It's a new monthly segment that we're going to start here on the morning show. One that's welcoming me back. One of our favorite chefs, Chef Jessica Bright. How good are morning. you? Good to see so you here. Good to be back. And who's here with us this morning? Well, I have brought two of my special friends, uh -huh. Lily and Haley Thomas. Aww. I've known Lily for a few years, and they have cooked with me on many occasions. <laughs> And so today, I, I thought they could help me make something. Very cool. You know, you, you talk so many, uh, so, so much about things that are going on with families, and families don't spend time together. And this is really a way for them to congeal and have fun and do things. It really is. It's so important because you get to be creative, you get to have fun, and you can help them make better decisions with what they eat and how they prepare their meals. There you, go. And you can dance, Lily, if you want. <laughs> she would, did you see her dancing? Lily's a very so, good dancer. <laughs> so what are we making today? Girls, do you know what we're making? Crepes. Yes. crepes. That's right, crepes. And crepes are pancakes. Um, they're actually a French style of pancakes. As you can see, they're very, very thin. Mm -hmm. And um, what I've done is I've taken a normal crepe recipe and made it a little healthier by grinding my own oat flour. I um, oh. made all the batter in the blender. Mm -hmm. I just poured in a half a cup of oatmeal and ground it till it was fine like this. And then I added um, the flour, baking powder, salt, and some confectioner sugar, and blend all of that till it's smooth. And then add some milk and two eggs. And then you end up with a nice batter like this, which is very, very thin. But you want to blend it so it's really smooth. And then I added one more special ingredient, which is orange zest. Oh, you know, one of my favorite yeah, things. Absolutely. And so um, the girls have helped me with this, and it's just how does that smell, Haley? Like orange. Yeah, <laughs> it really does, and it's wonderful. So once the crepes are made, which I've got a nice little stack of them here, mm -hmm. the fun part is we're going to take, um, if you could grab that orange zest I've prepared Ooh. and pour that into some vanilla yogurt. There you go. Which is going to give it a nice orangey flavor. And go ahead and You're stir gonna that. You're going to mix it up, Haley? Mm-hmm. All right. And then, Lily, if you could go ahead, and you can mix the yogurt and the strawberries together, or you can keep them separate. And I'm going to add, actually, why don't you do this? Go ahead and. Okay, while they're doing that, now do you, have, do you have to keep the crepe hot? No, you can put them in the refrigerator and keep them for a couple of days, yeah. or you can um, serve them right away. In my house, sure. um, normally a few of them disappear during production, mm -hmm. and then <laughs> see, I make some extras. You. And then we fill them up with fruit or with ice cream or whatever you'd like. You can use them as a dessert or as a breakfast item. Very cool. You guys having fun? Yeah. All right, you finish up that product and we're going to show it when we come back. Is that good? Mm -hmm. All right, we might even do a taste test. You think it's going to be good? <laughs> yes. Oh, of course it will. So if you'd like <laughs> Chef Jess's and the kids' recipe, well, I know you couldn't follow along, so it will be on we our website, newsforjacks.com, a little later this morning. What you do is you go to the main page. Over on the left-hand side, there's an area that says The Morning Show. Click on that, and that'll take you right to Jess's recipe. Thanks, guys. I can't wait to taste it. Well, we have this weekend's family-friendly events for you and your kids. And just moments away, your chance to win free tickets to the Home and Patio Show. It's uh, 8.53, 7 away from the top of the hour. You're watching Channel 4, the local station.